Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry Fan64 here. It's now time to do a movie review to Gentlemen Prefer Blondes, which I watched which I just got done watching not too long ago, and this is part of the Marilyn Monroe collection. This movie stars the late Marilyn Monroe Rest in Peace, Jane Russell and Gerald Coburn as well. <coughs> Excuse me. This is a 1953 film from 1981. And I'm also going to be doing a trailer review to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey t as well. So yeah. I might do the Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey review at in a separate video. So yeah. I'm going to do it my... I'm going to review the trailer review to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey after this video, actually. So yeah, I'm not in a hurry to review the Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2 trailer, but I'll review it eventually. So this movie I really enjoyed. This is probably this one beats Some Like It Hot is my favorite Marilyn Monroe movie. I think Some Like It Hot is better than this movie, but I still enjoyed this movie a lot. This is one hell of a fun movie. This one I watched on Hulu, and I will show the other show the other Marilyn Monroe question about that is um, Niagara, nineteen fifty three film in nineteen eighty. The both of them came out the same year. Spiny Air, Spiny Top Hat. Seductive and deeply disturbing. Marilyn Monroe starts in the film Noir Mirror Mystery. Not rated as an 89. Yes, vertical stick label. The 24th, again, 1992. The barcode fell off. And here's the VHS of this one. I, I'm going to give this movie a 10 out of 10 stars in A+. This is a great movie. This one here is my top act. Not rated and is a, a 92. With a vertical circle. Good barcode, but nothing. Because it's brand the 30 and then a 6. And you know what? I'm going to review the trailer review to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2. This movie, Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2, it looks pretty generic like the first movie, but I enjoyed what I watched through the trailer to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2. I watched the trailer yesterday. The movie doesn't look absolutely fantastic, but I hope it's better than the first one. The first one I thought was a guilty pleasure. I mentioned all my top 25 biggest guilty pleasure movies and my top... my favorite horror movies. So yeah, this movie, Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2, looks really, really awesome. And, and there's going to be more... Winnie the Pooh and Piglet are still going to be in the movie. And also, I heard that Tigger is going to be in it. I could be wrong. So this movie, I'm definitely going to get on DVD when it comes out. And I hope to get the first movie on DVD. So yeah, I'm going to give the trailer to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2 a ten, a, 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 an 8 out of 10 stars. And I'm going to give it a B+. Plus. No, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10 stars. And I'm going to give it a B+. Plus. So yeah, that is it for my movie review to Gentlemen Prefer Blondes and my trailer, my brief trailer review to Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey Part 2, which I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're generous enough, please consider leaving a like on this video and subscribe, plus it really helps out. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, everybody. Adios.